One of the first things that I had the privilege to do was uh, to stand in solidarity with uh, members of the Muslim community in, in Georgia around the Muslim ban. Uh, we fought that and, and the outpouring in Atlanta of support of people of all walks of life, of every ethnicity, every race, religion, um, I think that it was just says so much and I think it's also a result of some of the fabulous work that the Islamic Speakers Bureau has been doing. Recently I had a tremendous opportunity to participate in a Ramadan Ishtar at City Hall. And for me, it, you know, I was actually sitting at the table with some members of the Consular Corps, and so I, as an Atlanta, you know, history buff uh, and author of books on Atlanta history, sharing with them, the, you know, the significance of this, that the, that the city hall was designed to be exactly this gathering place for the community, a place where people from all across our community come together and celebrate together and learn to, to appreciate uh, each other's you know, stories and culture and history. And so um, it's just very much a part of, I think, who we have to be, the opportunity that we have to be. And I think Atlanta is such a great place for this work because it is so much the journey of Atlanta to be this place of inclusiveness and understanding and, and, and welcoming.